chilly autumn day today, so I figured I'd do a cozy witchy painting. I sketched out this little guy at the start of October, and I'm so excited to finally bring him to life. He's a frog who practices witchcraft in the pond. Pretty cool. Every time I do this, I wonder if I should have went with brighter colors, but I just don't really think that's who I am right now. So every color has been heavily mixed to be as bland as possible. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But I did use lots of red and orange to mute the greens and blues. I imagined a dark, wispy pond with hints of light, so I used a watered-down light blue to create all the magical dust in the background. I can't get over how content this frog is. You can tell he's really in his element. I wanted him to have spots, and I made the spots on his belly in the shape of the moon, so you know he was definitely born a frog witch. Or is it a witch frog? I don't really know. With some watered down dark blue, I went in and lightly shaded the area behind our froggy friend, and you can't really tell on camera, but it helped him stand out a lot. 
I also wanted the hat to stand out more and not get lost in the swampy background. When I imagined this piece, I also knew I wanted it to be framed with a grapevine wreath, so I super glued one on and I think it's perfect. Framing a piece goes a long way. Hope you have a wonderfully witchy Halloween, Samhain, and Blue Moon.